Hey guys, Smitty here with Just Pill and Barbecue. Welcome back, back to the channel. In today's video, I'm going to show you how easy it is to connect the Ironwood 885, or any Traeger for that matter, uh, to Wi-Fi. So stay tuned. Alright, so the first thing that I did was plug it in and now I'm going to hit the red switch back here in the back that turns the power on uh, and then hold in the power button here and fire it up. Now, to connect your grill to Wi-Fi you have to have the Traeger app and you have to be logged in to the Traeger app for this to work. So log in to the Traeger app. If you don't have a grill uh, already added, you're going to hit add grill. If you already have a couple of grills added, I've got two grills that are already connected to Wi-Fi already. Um, click on the name of whatever grill is shows up first, and it's going to pull that grill up, and then click the little arrow to the right, and Add Grill will show up. So you just need to find Add Grill and hit that. Once you hit Add Grill, it's pretty much self-explanatory. Which grill would you like to add? It's got Timberline 850, Timberline 1300, Ironwood 650, Ironwood 885. It's just got a list of the grills. And I'm going to hit Ironwood 885. Then it's got a data and privacy, uh, you know, the generic data and privacy deal that you have to agree to. So I'm going to agree to that. And uh, then it's going to show up your home Wi-Fi. And it says your grill will be connected to, and it has the name of my Wi-Fi. I'm not showing you the phone because some people get weirded out by showing you uh, account names and all that stuff. So, But it will say home Wi-Fi and it, yours should be listed. If it doesn't, then you need to back up. But it, it is showing mine um, and it says if it's not right, then it's going to tell you what to do afterwards. But I'm going to hit continue because mine's showing up. Now it says locate your QR code. So inside your hopper, there's my QR code right there, okay? QR code is right inside your hopper lid. So, it says I have a QR code or I do not have a QR code. If you don't, you're gonna hit I do not and it's gonna tell you what to do from there. But I do have one. So it says scan QR code. And I'm gonna hold it up there and boom, it scanned it. And now it says enter Wi-Fi password. So I'm going to enter it secretly. And hit continue. Traeger wants to join Wi-Fi network. Hit join. It says checking Wi-Fi connection. Now we're out here in the backyard. My Wi-Fi is on the front side of the house on that corner over there. Um, Traeger would like to find a connect to devices on your local network. I'm going to hit OK. I'm going to scan it again. Type in the password again. Grill connected to my network. It tells me the name of my network. Checking connection, checking for updates. If there are any updates available for this grill uh, that needs to be updated, maybe there wasn't an update done while it was sitting in a store or warehouse, then it'll go ahead and do that automatically. It says downloading files. So that's how easy it is to connect one of these Traegers to a Wi-Fi connection. It's really that simple. I just did it myself right here live in front of you. So uh, I hope this helps some of you guys when you get your Traegers with the Wi-Fi system uh, on how to connect your grill. I hope this helps. Uh, hit that like and subscribe button. Thank you. And until uh, next time, we'll be piddling.